I, I know you want to get in there like everybody else, but what does it mean when you have that chance to contribute twice in a week? Yeah, you know, it's uh, it's fun to get out there, you know, whenever uh, Sal needs a day off. Um, always ready to go. Um, whatever it calls upon, you know, if I got to do a hit and run, um, try to get my pitchers through uh, through through nine innings, um, try to come out with a win. So um, coming out with a win is the most important thing, you know, when you're not playing every day, you're not getting the everyday reps. Um, pretty much, like I said, just doing whatever it takes. Hey, Cam, we're seeing the highlight of the, the block and throw on Biggio yesterday. Take us through a play like that and just the reaction and, and, and how you prepare yourself you know, to be ready you know, to be you know, so efficient and, 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 and make those things happen with not regular playing time. Yeah, like you said, we're not playing every day. Um, you got to take the, the early work seriously, treat it like a game situation. Um, so that way when it does happen in the game, you're ready to go. Um, just being prepared, knowing that Josh has a really good curveball and he spiked it and just being, just making an athletic play and uh, just trying to get the runner out. And I know the relationship between the catcher, you know, and, and the pitcher is such an important one when it comes to making those, uh, you know, calling those pitches and making those plays like that. I guess your experience now with the, the time you have with this team has to be an important part of that, but you still have a lot of new guys coming in and out. How, how do you go about getting to know those guys at that level? Uh, you know, when, like, like I said, when you're not playing every day, um, come out and catch bullpens um, before the game. Sometimes, you know, if you haven't played in a couple days, you know, during the game, going out and catching them uh, while they're warming up, getting ready to get into the game, especially the relievers. Um, you know, just because that's the most kind of game-like situation that I'm going to get um, when I'm not playing. You know, it's it's easy to take, if you're an infielder and outfielder, you get those infield reps and stuff like that. But as a catcher, you don't really get too much game-like experience. So you just got to kind of do whatever whatever it takes to, to kind of get game-like situations in and get all the early work in and uh, just always be, be ready to go when your name's called. A couple of final questions. First off, uh, I'm just curious what the energy is like not in the dugout and on the field, but we're hearing about all these celebrations and dance parties. Winning is always fun. I think you guys celebrate a little different than Monty and his group did back in their day. It's generational. What's it like after a win? Oh, it's awesome. I'm there's something different. Um, the, the years I've been here, the, the just the, the camaraderie, everything, everyone getting together, everyone's close. Um, you know, it's you know when we win, we we enjoy it. You know, it's it's awesome. So yeah, everyone loves to win, but when we win, you know, we, it's. We like to have fun and, and cherish it and, you know, um, have as much fun as we can right then. And then as the day's over, we get ready to go and get ready for the next one the next day. And along those lines, too, it, it's been fun to watch sort of your generation, your class of players. You know, we had the, the Hosmers and the Moustakas. So certainly Salvi, Salvi was a part of that group in Duffy. But, but it looks like there's this developing core now of guys that came through the system like you and Dozier and Nikki and others. How, how much is that gelling? It's awesome. You know, like, like I said, it's, we first came up, you know, it was a little, we struggled a little bit, and, you know, you're kind of trying to figure out where you are in this league, and, you know, we, we, we got some guys now that have had a couple of years under their belt, and, you know, we're, we're, we were tired of losing the last few years, and we're ready to go, and we know we have a good team. We, got, we can throw the ball. We can hit. We got good defense, and, you know, pieces are coming together, and we're ready to roll. I know you're ready to roll every day whenever called upon, whether that's a bunt, best punter on the team, by the way, whether it's throwing a guy out. Those aren't my words. Those yeah. are Rusty's words. Yeah. So that's a big compliment there. But continued success. Keep it going. And hopefully we'll see you out there at some point later today. Will do. Thank you, guys. I appreciate it.